Uh, I'm Sir David Trippiard. During the next couple of minutes, I want to introduce you to not just another charity, not just another hobby, and certainly not an alternative religion. I want to share with you my story of a journey which I and thousands of men in our province of East Lancashire are taking along with millions around the world. It is a journey made by men of all faiths over many centuries, men of commitment with high values, a passion to do good, and most importantly, having fun along the way. Freemasonry is fun. Freemasonry gives us the opportunity to make lifelong friendships with people from all walks of life. Freemasons treasure family values. Our social events involve our wives, partners, children, and non-Masonic friends. My father was a Freemason, and I witnessed the journey and enjoyment he had through Freemasonry, and I wanted to follow in his footsteps. I've been on my own journey in Freemasonry for over 40 years. The first thing I learned about Freemasonry was that we are all equal. Wealth and social position are not important. Politics plays no part in Freemasonry. It is a fraternity of like-minded people from different backgrounds, cultures and religions. The caring part of Freemasonry is a huge attraction to me. With the exception of the National Lottery, Freemasons are the largest donator to charity. Each year, uh, our charities give hundreds of thousands of pounds for disaster relief and regularly donate tens of thousands of pounds for medical research and children's causes. The Grand Charity has donated well in excess of £100 million during the last 30 years. We also support a nursing home in Eccles in Salford. In addition, our province has its own charity supporting a local retirement home called Hewlett Court and other community activities. Many of our members also support their own local communities. Our members meet in Masonic halls throughout the province and lodge meetings are rich in ceremony which have a moral lesson teaching us about Freemasonry and importantly more about ourselves. To become a member you need to have a belief in a supreme being and have a good reputation. If you do become a Freemason, it is my firm belief that you will feel part of a centuries-old but modern international organization which is determined to play a part in encouraging good and thoughtful conduct, a love of family, uh, friendship, and a passion to help each other, and a desire to have enjoyment in good company. I will be proud to meet you and join in your journey through Freemasonry and ultimately help write the story of your own journey. If you require any further information or wish to learn more about Freemasonry, click on the link at the foot of this page.